episode number 10 of season three. That is wild. We are cruising. I hope you boys are loving the uploads. Um, I finally have broken my streak of not being able to close out games. Episode nine, I closed out a very close game with a resounding eight point victory. It was all tied up headed into the fourth. So that's a big game for us. We also have end game Shaquille O'Neal. I'm yet to really say that he's significantly better than the Invincible. In fact, he weighs like 80 pounds less than the Invincible. So for some reason, I feel like the Invincible might've been better. The Venus sky hooks are looking amazing though. We get to keep Mono Ginobili since Muggsy Bugs is not actually gonna get any reps, contrary to popular belief. Devin Booker was like the sixth man of the year last game. He was shooting lights out. LeBron was all right. Mobley was all right. David Robinson was all right. So can't say much about them. Cade Cunningham close to his brand new Invincible. If we get a win here, he's the Invincible, which means I wouldn't even need to replace Manu anyway. So I feel like for today's wheel spin, getting a Dark Matter backup center would be pretty awesome. You guys know the vibes. I love our starting lineup. The mellows ball out. Giannis, okay. This Giannis is awesome, but he gets fatigued stupid fast. Like, I feel like every second or third quarter, he's just fucking slow motion dribbling the ball up the court. So I might want to look into replacing him as well. But if it ain't broke, don't fix it, right? Like, should I really replace Giannis? The wheel's gonna tell me right here. Let's see what our wheel spin is. It's jackpot, but name their college. Shit, I'm such a casual. I'm such a cat. I could hardly do this with NFL, bro. You think I'm gonna do this with NBA? Any player in the game, but I gotta name their college. Ow, I can't just go and choose any single player. I have to search through the auction house. We're gonna use the first 20 players on the auction house that are dark matters. So I can go through any of these players, but I must name their college. Okay, Jordan is North Carolina. I'm good there. Shaq is LSU, but he's already on my team. Bonchero's Duke. I think low-key, bro, I wanna go Paolo Banchero. I have no idea where J.R. Smith went to college. I'm gonna just throw up a guess and say Kentucky. He didn't even go to college. You don't have to worry about internships with them because they definitely ain't going to college. What college did you go to, Mike? Let's go! So Jordan's an option right now. Bonchero's an option. LeBron also didn't go to college. Larry Bird went to Indiana. Indiana State. Shit! He didn't even go to the Hoosiers? Damn, I'm a casual. Garnett? No clue. In fact, I feel like Garnett came straight out of high school. Mo Bamba. Oh, it's a blue team, isn't it, right? Was he on a blue team? I'm gonna say Kentucky. Oh, I'm a casual. Taco Fall? He was uh, Purdue. Taco Fall, Purdue. I'm just getting stupider and stupider. Okay, Anthony Davis with North Carolina, 100%. Fuck! Ah! Who am I thinking of? Shaq, LSU again. I mean, I already knew that. Yao Ming, China? Is that a college? <laughs> I don't think so. I say we go Bonchero because then we can take David Robinson out. My only concern is that Bonchero's actually like very undersized. Like I almost think David Robinson might be better. Okay, so he has insane A pluses everywhere. Here's what we're gonna do. So David Robinson comes out for Bonchero. And then I hate to say it, Derek, but I gotta take you out. We're gonna put David Robinson in here and then Cade Cunningham's there. Gentlemen, gentlemen, gentlemen. This team is ready to go. It's never been more ready. Bonchero added to the squad. And with those end game Taco Fall and end game J.R. Smith packs, I really want to complete this challenge wheel. So let's see what we're gifted. Oh, this one's so sick. Shout out to you guys in the comments for coming up with this. Recreate an iconic shot. So I have to recreate one iconic shot from one player on my team. I feel like out of these players, I think LeBron James and Carmelo Anthony are going to have the most iconic shots. I mean, Shaq's iconic shots, I feel like are going to be too close to the hoop. You know, I'm going to do this challenge with LeBron James. LeBron James has about a million different iconic shots, right? But I think one of my favorite ones is super young LeBron in the playoffs against the Orlando Magic. Magic are winning the series one to zero. It's 95 Orlando, 93 Cleveland. There's one second left in the clock. They inbound the ball to LeBron at the top of the key. He pulls up and just drills it. So to complete my challenge, I have to recreate that LeBron James shot. Now, obviously the score doesn't need to be the same and there doesn't have to be one second on the clock because then I'd only have one attempt at it and I, it was just impossible. All I have to do is recreate that made shot. Also a huge thank you to Dr. Squad for sponsoring today's video. Dr. Squatch is changing personal care with high-performing natural products that make you look and smell amazing. You've actually probably heard me talk about their limited bars of soap before, like Moon Rock, Area 51, and my personal favorite, the Mars Bar. I never have enough of these. But Dr. Squatch is taking it to a whole new level with their newest limited bar. This is the Crypto Cleanse Bar. It combines everything you love about crypto culture, memes, NFTs, all into one bar of soap, and of course, 
It smells absolutely amazing. I can't wait to use this. So it's limited edition, so you're gonna wanna act quickly. The coolest part, they're running a sweepstakes right now. Three winners will be chosen to receive one of three custom designed NFTs plus a $500 Dr. Squatch gift card. So no matter what, you can get your hands on some amazing limited bars of soap from Dr. Squatch. But in the best case scenario, you walk home with a $500 gift card and your own custom NFT. There is no purchase necessary. There's a link in the top of the description. It'll have all the information for you. So I recommend you click that. Additionally, Dr. Squatch does have a full lineup of natural products for every part of your routine. So I know they're gonna have something you love. Check out the sweepstakes link in the top of the description and enjoy the rest of the video. D Wade, John Wall, Mello, Russell, and he's got a LeBron of his own. LeBron is on Shaq. Okay, so actually, if I call a timeout, it will let me inbound the ball from that wing. So right now, I actually have a shot at it already, as long as LeBron isn't inbounding. Damn it! LeBron is inbounding the ball. Is it who calls the timeout? Oh, what defense. Spectacular. Let's pass the ball to Yao, and let's call the timeout. I need to understand who inbounds the ball. Is it always the three who inbounds the ball? If that's the case, I gotta move LeBron. Hello? Shit! Yam. God damn it. All right, let's pull LeBron for Giannis, and then where can we put LeBron? He's gotta be so frustrated with how many timeouts I'm calling. I'm sorry, my guy. Why is LeBron still inbounding the ball? Everyone's saying, no, there is not a way to change who inbounds the ball. Well, if LeBron inbounds the fucking ball every time, I can't recreate the shot. All right, that's the closest I can get. We're gonna do a different iconic shot since apparently LeBron is my inbounder no matter what. I think this guy sucks dick and balls at this game, so I have time to think. John Wall, you're small. Not that small. Nobody has scored in two minutes of basketball. Okay, the game winner that I'm going for. LeBron hit a game winner on Miami against Golden State with Andre Iguodala guarding him. It was a step back three from the left side. He dribbles the ball up the court, waits for the clock to wind down, steps back to his left and drills it with point one on the clock. That's the game winner we're going. For. So he's dribbling, he's right here, walks it up to the left side, steps back left. Oh shit, that was actually would have been it. The only problem is he's cold right now because I've missed so many already. So let's go get him a dunk. Let's just get him hot. Or not hot, but not cold at least, right? Uh, it's gonna be an interesting game, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get this dialed in. There's another slam for LeBron. He shouldn't be cold anymore. I don't know what his takeover is. Probably a slasher. I'm sorry, John Wall. Unfortunately, you cannot guard Yami. Get it out to Bron. Oh, do it, Bron. That's I just went on the bones. You're not double teaming me, are you? So we're dribbling. We're dribbling right here. Cut left. Hard to the basket. Step back. Oh! <laughs> Are we counting that one, boys? Hey, you know what, boys? In, just in case we don't count that, I'm gonna try it again as a buzzer beater. With no time in the first quarter, I'm gonna try that again. That was nasty, though. Great defense here. You know what? I'll just do it again. Let's just recreate it three times. I mean, it kind of helps that this guy fucking sucks, but all right, we're here, we're here. Dribble left hard. Ooh, that's not it. I think my first recreation was good. Dude, this guy is struggling. Mans can't even hit free throws right now. His team is not bad. He just isn't very good. Into Manu. Wanu Ginobili. Oh. No way. Good pump. Step back. Devin Booker! 17-6. to It's going to be a wash if he plays this out. I think it's fair to say we've already, already recreated the challenge wheel. Mello! I literally haven't even made a defensive adjustment because he's just so bad. Little pump fake, should be a dickhead. Ooh, okay. Good D, Mello. Into Shaq, what a dish. Ooh, almost a rip. Good D, I lied, it wasn't good. Dude, did his whole team just activate their X Factor? Okay, Shaq, endgame Shaq is so much weaker than my other Shaq. He doesn't play strong at all. I want him to do this and then, okay. Maybe I was just using him wrong. Maybe I was just not making good post moves. William Russell, I'm sorry, but you're a little bitch. It, 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 are we all seeing the same thing? Go up Shaq. That's what I want out of my endgame Shaq, baby. All right, good pump fake here. Yup. Oh, good move. Oh shit, not a good move. 
God damn it. If I don't win this game by 20 or a rage quit, it's a loss. Yes, sir! Oh, no! All right, I'm, gonna win. I'm winning this game by 20 or more or a rage quit. That was literally the, one of the worst quarters of 2K I've ever played in my whole life. Bingo. Good rip. Good rip. Run it, Shaq. That's a good shot. That's a good shot. Very open. Good pass. Shaq, just be big! You're big! You're so small. You're so small, Shaq. Left mellow open. It's now a three-point game. All right, I'm just going to play basketball. No more shenanigans. I'm just going to play. Maybe I got to do a takeover with LeBron. Or maybe I just got to play 2K and not try to put a takeover on anybody. That is... Dude, how is he slamming on you? That never happened. Mello into the paint. <sighs> All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Just stay composed. We're gonna be fine here. Match up. I think he knows that. Ron, I see you. Get up. Get up. Get up. Don't do this animation shit, please. What do you know? It does the. It does the animation where they lie on the ground for fucking a million seconds, and his player is gonna get a bucket. Hey, good layup. Good layup. Hey, good D, good D. Return to sender. Mello. Big three! What is going on? All right, well, he got the ball back, I guess. So that's nice. Dude, what the fuck? This is insane. We're, we're really bad right now. This is one of the worst guys I've ever played. And I'm just struggling to do anything. I'm gonna do it, boys. I'm winning by 20. A rage quit. 20 or rage quit. And one! Bubbly goes up, gets a foul from Draymond Green, and this is the start of our run, baby. This is the start of our run right here. I'm gonna do it. I just needed a second to dial in. Let's get there, Wade Wanningham. Shit. Shit. Go D, get that shit out of here. Ooh, Paolo Bonchero is gonna get his first bucket of the game. LeBron has the sharpshooter takeover? Now I really wanna activate it. Is he looking for last shot? Can't really tell. LeBron to the line for one, two. All right, up by 12. I have to win by 20 or more. He won't even get a shot off. Good D, Kate. Oh, Kate Cunningham sent that shit so far. On him with Devin Book. Another one for Bonchero. Bron. Hey, with the poster. Let's get it. Low key, I'm almost activating his takeover. Mobley with the clamps. That's a horrible shot. Let's go. Hey, this is it, boys. This is that run I was telling you about. <gasps> what a step back. Oh my God, that wasn't the shot. Still nasty, and he's going to get a free bucket because of it, but whatever. He's 100% shooting in the second half. Damn. This guy's pretty good at that inbound steal. But I'm better defense. Let's go. Get up, right on Kareem. Ooh, got swatted. Okay, free free three, he's gonna hit that. 56-46. Let's just take free. That's a free bucket, let's take it. Into Shaq. Don't gotta get fancy. Oh, nice move. Shit. Good ass, oh, no assist. Bron! Stop going out of bounds, Bron. Go, Bron! Hey! Holy shit, he's gassed. And he still did that. I just want this takeover, LeBron. I know we can get it, baby. Good defense, LeBron. We can get this. Good pump fake. It's just little ass J.R. Smith. Yup. Good move. Come on, LeBron! No, he's too tired. Make it one more time. Oh, he knew what I was doing. Come here, J.R. Smith, you little bitch! Damn it! Oh, that's how close I am, bro. Look how close I am to this takeover. I'm just too tired. Oh, he did it. Not J.R. Smith, bro. Not ever I talked all that shit. Just got computer Giannis jumping. I'm not going to win by 20 or get a rage quit. Although I could still win by 20. I just got heat up. Good steal. Yes. Yes. Super tired LeBron. Where are you? Yes. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I could do both. Okay. Uh, tired LeBron. What? No, not Draymond, bro. Yes, tired LeBron. Yes, tired LeBron. Up by 15. 20 seconds left. No. Oh. 
Good, 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 good. Up by 15, come on, we gotta go up by 20. Shit, that was so free, I literally just let him walk at the hoop. Hello? Okay, not a great shot. Wow, my own personal goals that I set, I just couldn't accomplish. Oh, what a fuck! Ah! Oh wait, it was a... <laughs> I didn't realize there was no time on the clock. I thought he literally just missed that. Oh my God, dude, what if that was a game winner? What if I was gonna win the game off that shot? I, I feel like I personally, even though I get a win, I feel like I personally feel like I suck. And I just didn't even play that well. 28 points for LeBron, 12 for 23. I, I was supposed to recreate an iconic shot with LeBron, so I went off for LeBron. Uh, Shaq had 18, nine for 18, dude. I swear to God, I want my other Shaq. I almost strongly feel like I want my other Shaq. I, I'm doing it, or I'm putting in Invincible Shaq. This is gonna piss some people off, but I swear to God, I like my Invincible Shaq better. He's stronger, bro. He, He's 80 pounds stronger, and he does have less Hall of Fame badges, but half of those badges are irrelevant. Hall of Fame chef increases the range for off the dribble three-point shots. I don't need any of that shit. I want a big heavy center, and this invincible Shaq does it, so I'm not switching it up. Although that does make me think now I should probably go endgame mellow. Next episode, I might have endgame mellow, because I did say I, I'm entitled to one endgame. And of course, we did recreate our iconic shots. Who would I want? I think I'd want a taco fall. Having taco fall would be insane. I'm gonna go and end game taco fall pack we only get one pack for completing our challenge wheel it's a pink diamond <laughs> damn would have been fire number 23 is this a lebron this is a lebron this is oh my fucking god it's an 06 07 lebron that is insane bro i was sitting here recreating iconic cavaliers lebron shots and we just pulled cavaliers 06 07 lebron he's not gonna make it on the team oh 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 and how dare we forget we just got our final win for power up Cade Cunningham. So invincible Cade Cunningham becomes my backup point guard. I can't wait. I seriously cannot wait to use this Cade Cunningham. Love the squad. I think I'm gonna start LeBron from now on over Giannis. That LeBron is actually nasty. I like him better than the Giannis. And uh, I like my squad. Just might have an end game mellow next time too. So stay tuned for that. Hey, love you boys. Thanks for watching as always. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.